Today's game has been sponsored by the COVID-19 vaccine. Get it as soon as you possibly can. Waiting off Nathan Michael, the senior shortstop. Jimmy Cooney on the mound for this Olmstead Falls Bulldogs school. Nathan waiting on the first pitch and it's going to be a ball. Oh, one up. Oh, you can see a zero right there on the screen. One, two, three. That's how it was for Olmstead Falls in the first. And there's a hot shot. Good play by the shortstop. He'll throw down a first and oh, oh what's it called? Safe. He beats it out. That's an infield single. How about that? Nice attempt there by Anthony Lyons, but he couldn't get it. One up, if I can get it, looks like this. After Nathan comes Mitchell Good, Derek Evans, Carter Oviat, Gwen Marquis, Carter Connor Oviat, Jacob Burr, Aaron Phillips, and Brandon Whipchuk ending that. We saw a ball right there. Cooney on the mound for Homestead Falls. Catching is Denko as it's one ball, no strikes to count. And two balls, no strikes. Jeff Drift at first. And second is trying to find out Ryan Viscanic. And third is Maui Kilbane. And look at that 3 0, don't go. Waiting on deck is Derek. Of course, Anthony Lyons. Sorry about the sideway camera. Of course, Lyons right there, it's short. Three balls, no strikes. And ball four, take your base. Two on, no one out, Derek Evans. Wind is just being mean. Ah. Ball four, that's right, Carson Ball four out left. At center field is Carter Gast. Right field is Mikey Vay Jr. Finally, I can put this Miles darn thing down. Derek Evans to the plate here. Two on, no one out. Swing and a miss. Want to hit one out of here. Oh, one, of course, as mentioned. It's not that far out. I mean, yet again, Science Dealers have like 315 on the left. Derek going two. Fouls that one. I was listening to top of the first, and all I could hear was the wind. I think this microphone's hitting my shirt. Boy, oh boy. It's just got ugly out here. Ball one. The runners aren't going. At least just yet. There's the howling wind out here. Granger Elementary School. Fouls that one. One, two. And we can just see it everywhere out here. Dirk and anyone out of here, that would be huge for the Hornets. The question is, will we get it out of here? We don't know yet. That's why you play. Here's your one, two. Ball two. Good idea to. Bring that bad boy off on deck if I can find the man on deck. Oh, there it is. Carter Oviat. Mm. Two and two. Of course, you might see a triple play. But now it was one to oh two. Now Derek works up to three and two. Nathan at second. Mitchell's out at first. Carter just waiting to swing that bad boy. Full count, wind howling. This is ridiculous. Andrews flying. And there's a high fly ball out in there. And oh, he doesn't catch it. Or oh, nope, if you fly. Lions couldn't handle it, but it looks like the umpire called the infield fly rule on that. Trying to prevent that, that would have been double play. So Lions gets away with one there. Or maybe we get away with one. I think he got away with one. Nathan probably would have gone down third and Mitchell probably would have been out. Carter. 
Take strike one. Nothing in one. Going go fielder out there. And here we go. Jimmy Cooney set. He kicks out one pitch coming up, and that's a wall. Runners don't go. And hopefully the wind can tie down out here. Looks like it is a little bit. Hit a double play out here by Carter. Won't get a double play out of that, but it's a 1-2 count. Oh, you heard the left fielder again. Here for Scanic. Jeff for Scanic, I think. Oh, hit him! Take your base! Take your base! Base is just one out. One out here in the first inning. Quinn Mark was to the plate. We'll see if Quinn can do some damage out here. So far, Cooney has allowed one hit, infield hit. Then a block, then an infield fly, and then a hit batter. Exactly not what he wanted. And the ball. I think the one carried that. Looks like that. I want dug out if I can get it. Not pleased. One and all. Oh. Here it comes. Foul. I don't know how the players do it out here on a windy day like this. Of course, you can hear the wind from your computer or phone, tablet, whatever device, maybe your television. And that's a wild pitch, but Nathan not budging. 2 and 1. Nathan at third. At second, Mitchell, and at first, Carter. Quinn is up. As long as if he can hit a fly ball out there, I'm pretty sure Brandon can score on that. Of course, there's not really that big of a backstop out here at Granger Field. But it's not that, not too many backstops. As there is a base hit in the left. One scores. Mitchell thinking two. Here's a throw home, and he scores. Throw down to second, he's out. Carter got a little greedy, but who cares? It's a distraction. A two-run single. Quinn Marquist delivers with a base hit and the hole out and left. Scoring Brandon and Mitchell. Connor's up to the plate now. The designated hitter. Going through eight minutes of this first. Whoa, high and away on that. This wind. I've been mentioning a lot out here today, but good heavens, it's shaking the camera a little bit. And the throw down is second, place to a second. Jeez. Of course. No double play with two outs, but it gets rid of that force. Not just that, kind of can slap one. And no, Quinn's not afraid. Three balls, no strikes. Finally, went dying. 3 0, don't go. Crouching down to look and see who's on deck. That's Burr on deck. Okay. Jacob Burr on deck. Sorry if the camera's being a problem out here. Connor takes ball four. Take your base. Take a walk. Issued by Jimmy Cooney. Two on, two out. Burr looking for a three run bomb. Could it happen? I don't know. Not really deep ballpark according to the players. I mean, at a professional level. Whoa, whoa. 350 out there to center. They're looking for that bus garage as a target. Basically, yeah, as one of those hit it here signs. That's a ball. I mean, yep, there it is. The bus garage. All the buses go right there. All the buses right there. That's uh, going to get away and advance both. So, with that, you see. Quinn at third and Connor at second. And an empty bag at first. Once again, eliminating a force. Well, there's a bird out there. 3 0. 
don't go, don't go. Just don't go at all. Wind's just being cool. On deck or would be next. Aaron. Get this. I'll just hold it. 3-0, don't go. And ball four. Take your base. Third walk today for Jimmy Cooney. He is dancing with danger. And as I always say, danger is not a good dancing partner. Aaron from football, the law firm, and of course the, who do you call him? Basketball team. Looks like there's going to be a talk out there. This is absolutely crazy. Of course, there's a soccer field out there. High school team does not play soccer there, I'll tell you that. They play it at the tire, which is past those trees, beyond those trees. And of course, softball field. Girls won 7 2 yesterday. But there was not a mean old win. This is just. issues out here for Jimmy Cooney, but can you really blame him? Try pitching with sharp wind like this. 2-0. Nobody is in the bullpen. Of course, there is not a bullpen for, or there isn't a bullpen for the visiting school, but there is for us. I just found that little here it is. That is going to be a ball. 3 0, 3 0. Don't go. Brandon would be next. This one, he probably will. Good strike. But Aaron obviously had to take that. Two hands on this. Three and all the count. Rio, you don't go. That's the rule. Here it comes. Here's a ground ball second. Throw down and that'll do it. Two run score. We leave him loaded. Do nothing good guy. 